Duffy! It was a hat-trick for Duffy last night as she cleaned up at the Brit Awards. The Welsh singer won Best Album for Rock Fairy, Best Breakthrough Act and beat the likes of Adele and Estelle to get Best British Female Solo Artist. A British female, I don't know what that means but it's a good job. I suppose my mum didn't have a boy. But there was no mercy for Coldplay. The supergroup showed up to perform but despite four nominations, left empty-handed. Better news for girls allowed, though. After years of nominations, they finally won for Best British Single. It all seems like a bit surreal at the minute, to be honest. We've been together for like seven years now, so this is just the cherry on the cake for all these years. Meanwhile, Elbow added to their Mercury Music Prize. They won the Best British Group Award. And after years of relative obscurity, the very outfit were thrilled. Uh, seriously, thank you very, very much for everybody. Uh, who, who helped us out, uh, in particular our sweethearts and families. Other winners on the night included Kings of Leon, who took Best International Album and were crowned Best International Group. Thank you, God. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, UK. Y'all are amazing. Without y'all, we would be nothing. Nothing. Thank you. Kanye West won Best International Male, while Katy Perry scooped Best International Female, turning up to collect despite being a little under the weather. I'm so sick right now. <laughs> but they said I should show up to the Brits because something special might happen. Veteran rockers Iron Maiden took the Best Live Act Award, while Florence and the Machine were named Critics' Choice. Hello. The ceremony at London's Earl's Court was co-hosted by Kylie and comedy duo James Corden and Matthew Horne. And the Aussie singer found some new backing dancers. The show was rounded off with a medley from pop legends, the Pet Shop Boys, who received an outstanding contribution award. But ultimately, it was Duffy's night. Bagging the most silverware, she was, well and truly, the queen of the Brits.